oh, oh, that magical dog. He's going to go to Los Angeles, California. Yes, he is, Doug the Dinosaur. Yes, he is, kid. Hey, and welcome to our adventurous kid time story time. Oh, oh, but you know what I need to go to Los Angeles, California, don't you? Oh, I know. These. Oh, yeah. Oh, I, I better get them adjusted. Okay. Y'all, you get them adjusted. I'm going to adjust the book so we can enjoy the next adventure coming before us. Where is Big Sil going to take us today? Stuck inside on a rainy gray day, little Ange, there she is, and Big Sil, there he is, imagine fun places to play. Big Sil's magic tail wags, there we go, and little Ange, <gasps> Gasps in surprise, Big Sil jumps into her book right before her very eyes. <gasps> Big Sil lands in warm, sunny LA. Woohoo! It's a beautiful day to go out and play. Look at that. There's Big Sil looking up. Look at the tall buildings. Look at the beautiful blue sky. People walking through the streets. Look at the palm trees. Oh, yeah. L.A. Hollywood. Big Sil visits an observatory with a view. Look at that. Big, beautiful observatory. He learns about the universe the whole way through. Ooh. And these are all real places in L.A. So when you go, kid... You can have a list of cool places to offer your parents as potential visitation spots. Big Sil sees stars at a show in the dark. Ooh, that's a planetarium. The stars are sparkling almost as much as my fingertips. Big Sil sees a waterfall on a hike in Griffith Park. Look at that beautiful park. Yes. Outdoorsy, nature. That's what I love about California. It's so always beautiful outside. It makes you want to be out in it. In Hollywood, Hollywood, there's more to explore. At the Movie Makers, Big Sill takes a studio tour. Oh, look at this. This is Paramount Pictures. Yeah, they give tours in there. And sometimes if you arrange it ahead of time, you can actually go see the taping of a show, like a comedy or something that you might like. Big Sil goes to the farmer's market for fresh food. Lots of healthy fruit puts him in a good mood. <laughs> Me too. Nothing like a piece of fresh fruit on a sunny, beautiful, bright blue day. Look at that. Not a cloud in the sky. Farmer's market. That's where the locals go too. And you want to live like a local sometimes. Big Sil trots down the boulevard along the Walk of Fame. Look at that. The stars along the sidewalk. That's a real place. You can take a photo down on the ground. You see people get low and take a photo by stars of their favorite stars. You know, one day, one day, Big Sill will have a star to mark his name like that. And see, that's kind of how people take pictures. Not exactly like Big Sill if they don't have paws hanging out, but that's kind of what they do. Isn't this a fun trip? I'm enjoying myself immensely. At the tar pits, black goo gurgles up slow. There are fossils from 38,000 years ago. That's the La Brea tar pits. Look at that real tar. That's not water. That is black goo. And you could see when you're there, it doesn't look like water. Maybe from afar, but when you get close, you see it, it's thick. And yeah, actual fossils of animals stuck in the tar pits are in there. It's amazing. Well, Big Sil goes to an art museum on Gallery Row. Big Sil tries surfing for the first time. Whoa! Look at that. A little art, a little sporting activity, a little something for everybody, every taste, for your mind and your body. Ah. Santa Monica Pier glows as the sun starts to set. Big Sil walks on the beach, but he never gets his paws wet. I guess he's a little bit water phobic, are we, Big Sil? Come on, you can jump through a book, you can jump into the water. And this is a beautiful pier. You could see it from far away as you're approaching, and it's full of, uh, it's like a permanent carnival. So it's full of rides and things there. And it is 
right by the beach. So you can take in the sunset at the same time that you're there. Now Big Sil wags his tail that special way. He arrives home safe at the end of the day. Little Ange and Big Sil dream of more places to see. Where will the next adventure be? Let's visit America. Look at that giant book right there. I bet it's going to be another place in America. And I bet it's going to be pretty awesome. Hey, 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 Green Bear, I didn't know you were here. I didn't know that you were going to Hollywood without me. You know that I'm an aspiring superstar and also a movie executive mogul in the making. I should have gone with you. Well, it's okay. Just hit rewind and you can watch the story too. Okay, okay. You better not have gotten Doug the Dinosaur a part in a big movie without me. No, I did not get him a big part, but if he did, it's okay. Other people can have success too, you know. Well, I guess it's true. I guess movies do have a lot of people in them. Exactly, exactly. Okay, okay, I feel better now. But don't go to Hollywood again without me, okay? Okay, promise. I promise. I'll take you with me to Hollywood next time. Okay. Okay. All right, kid. I hope you enjoyed the Lost Angeles adventure of Big Sill. I sure did. <laughs> I see you were waiting for Green Bear to leave. Yeah, sometimes Green Bear can be a little bit, uh, uh, uh. You can tell me. Well, intense. Yeah, yeah, that's true. I totally agree. Did you enjoy the adventure? Oh, yeah, yeah. The, the tar pits. I can't believe that there are bones in there from 38,000 years ago. Wow. I know. Isn't that incredible? I'm preserved for science and for us to know the kinds of animals that roamed the earth and roamed California back in the day. Yeah, I'd say 38,000 years ago. That's really back in the day. All right, Kate. Well, I'll see you on the next adventure because we're not done, are we? No, no. As you say, storyteller. Can I say it? Can I say it? Yep, yep. Can't stop, won't stop. <laughs> see you next time, Kate, on Kid Time Story Time, where we can't stop, won't stop.